Guys, welcome to another Toy Mention new toy. So it's not really a new toy. It's actually a Witchblade. And it was 1998. All rights reserved. Oh, who's the babe? Anyways, got this from uh, the local store down the road, uh, C4 Entertainment. They have a lot of older stuff, new stuff. They can order stuff for you guys now, too. Medieval Witchblade from Witchblade. Sculpted by Claiborne Moore, armed with Witchblade armor, weapons, includes Witchblade stand. Uh-oh. So, I have a bunch of these toys already, so... But, I already asked that question. Who's the babe? So, okay. A little bit about her. The medieval welder of the mystical Witchblade. Katrina embodied the spirit of a warrior. A woman of endurance and incredible fighter. She believes in justice and delivered it to those who did wrong. Nice. That's her. I guess back in the day, I don't know if you can though, More moreaction.com. Check it out. Let me know if it's real. All right. So let's... Let's see, choking hazard, of course. Not for children under six. Hmm. Recommended for mature collector ages 18 and over. Okay. Well, she is pretty revealing in a way. So, let's pop her open. Let's pop this cherry, right? So, I like stuff like this because it's not popular. I like fancy stuff. I like shiny stuff. I like superheroes. But I, I have a thing for non-important stuff because I like to learn about it. I like to know a little history. I like to know about it. So, Top Cow. More action collectors. Okay. That's her. There's her stand right there. Let's pop that out. Pretty nice. I see... One peg hole. So, pretty cool, huh? Witchblade. All right. Next is, we have a sword. I like stuff like this too, medieval stuff, swords. This ain't like the coolest looking sword, but it does have green, guys. Not bad, huh? It is a another hard plastic. Yes, it will warp and bend. But it'll straighten right back out. So it's a hard plastic, yes. I bet you can probably poke someone's eye out with it, so be careful. So next is an axe. I got a freaking axe, guys. I have never had a toy yet with an axe. Besides my sub zero. Which is a nice axe, so it doesn't really count, so. Looks like there's bandaging going around over there. Of course, you got the blades. That's pretty thick. Actually, it's more like a hammer in the back here. Yep. The tips are sort of sharp-ish. Obviously, it's not a real blade, so... Yes, you can probably stab yourself with it. Yes, it hurts, so be careful. Next up is a... A spear. Now spears are cool. I like Mortal Kombat, I like Jade. She don't have a spear. She has like a staff. Staffs are cool. So you can pretty much pretend it's a staff. And of course it looks it's wrapped up in green too. That blade. No. Witch blade. I don't know how they sharpen these things. That's pointy too. That's that's sharper than a sword, guys. So that's pretty cool. I like that. Oof. She's, she feels dangerous already, guys. All right. Now let's pull our lady out. Pop her out of here. Uh, okay. Here she is. Now, looks like she has armor here. It's cool. She does not at all move her wrist. 
which is a long ponytail. Her head moves. Left or right, real easy, but barely, guys, so. Next arm, moves up and down. They're both stiff, guys. The wrists don't move at all. We, this way you get, you know, 90s toys. It's awesome. They're more collectible types. They're hardcore-like. Her legs, though, rotate. Okay. But it, she's really restricted on posing. So, all right. Both hands. This one, obviously, looks like she can... That's probably I'm going to put her spear in that one. This one's open, so I can either put the axe or the sword in there. Since I like swords better. Oh, okay, so peg hole. Little peg hole. I got some random number down there. So, whatever. Alright, so I'm going to put her on her stand here. Check. Let's see. Rotate her leg a little bit. Boom. I got her stand. Yeah, she's pretty sexy. She looks like she has like armored legs too. Also looks like fishnet. Not bad, not bad. Obviously adult toy because, well, she shows a little bit. Like a little bikini thing going on. I don't get some of that. If it's supposed to be armored, because if you see the guys that are armored all the time, they're they're pretty much their whole bodies. So it's a sexy peel thing, guys. That's all it is. So, but I do love her ponytail. That is wow. What's cool about it too? The ending of it looks like it looks like a scorpion tail, almost, but obviously it's hair. And that's sharp too, guys. Just so you know. All right. So next up, the staff. The spear. Let's see. Let's so stick it in there. That sounded really bad, guys. Oh, dropped. Mm, change of plans. I'm going to put the staff or the spear. Oh. I just broke it. That is not cool. So I'm gonna have to modify later on. Man, that's not cool. I'm gonna cry later, guys. All right, so I'll put that to the side, but I will put that back together. Gorilla glue is awesome. Or I can do like a little, little piece of black tape or something like that, so. All right, so what I'll do is put her ax Actually, I bet the sword goes in there. Yep. Sword goes in there, perfect. Check. So, okay. So the spear and the axe have the same handle, pretty much. So, obviously, open palm, open fist. So we'll stick that in there. So I should have put the spear in there first, which was actually my change of plans I was gonna do, so. All right. Boom. Okay. That is so sad about the spear, guys. I'm sad now, guys. Alright, so. Alright, that's her. I wish she could pose better, though. Honestly. She has barely any movement. What I can do. Not bad. Bless her. Katrina. Wait, I hope I said the name right. Katrina Witchblade. Love it. Minus the spear breaking. That's very, very embarrassing, guys. That's not the first thing I broke on camera. But we'll get over it. That is cool, though. But she looks like she's gonna fall over. So modify a little bit, check. Alright. So 
Looks dangerous. So, what do you guys think? I wouldn't want to mess with her. But I hope you guys like it. Like, share, subscribe, and let me know if you guys do reviews on stuff like this or talk about it because I like stuff like this and I want to know if there's more out there. So, until next time, kitties, I hope you like, share, and subscribe. And this ain't going away. This will be put together again. So, I got to do it for my shelf, of course. So, like I said, probably fix it. Gorilla glue or a little piece of tape. Make it look like it's a, a handle or something like that. It's cool about the technology these days and stuff that make. You can fix anything, do all kinds of stuff. Just some things I don't have the time to do. So, for this one, I'm going to make time for it. All right, guys. Like, share, subscribe. Uh, leave a like, please. Definitely leave a like. Um, but thank you for your time. Until next time, kitties. Remember, you can never go wrong with toys.